Okay. Oh my God. I got a guy asking me online. I'm sorry. I just fucking recorded so much shit and it was doing it vertically. Um, I got a guy online asking me, um, or on YouTube commenting, asking me how to get the, the, the fucking barrel off. Um, I just went through this bullshit. It just pisses me off. Um, my mag was not going up in there and it was stuck on something and it ended up being stuck on this little piece right here, which is connected to the hammer. So if you ever have an issue where your mag won't go past this point, pull the hammer back and then well, pull the hammer back, push the mag up. You should be good. Um, I was saying these California fucking safeties are, uh, safeties that they put on these are goddamn stupid. California is retarded. They make the gun more dangerous than it would be if they just left the shit alone. That's how dumb they are because me personally, I would never work. I don't work on guns, clean them, tear them down, anything with a fucking mag anywhere near them. I've unloaded the gun. The ammo's right there. Chamber's clear. I just pulled the fucking trigger, but there is actually a hammer safety on this too, but again, I checked it. So, here's the dumb shit, right? With the mag in, it pushes this little bar right here up out of the way. I don't know if it'll focus on that good enough. But it's, it's hovering above this just enough that you can push it down and put it into fire. Right? But the other problem with that is... Well, let me explain this. The reason you have to do that is because if the mag's out... Then you can't fucking drop this. Normally you would have the plate on here. If I wanted to, I could just pick this up and do it. But then you can't drop this. And this holds the fucking slide forward. This locks the slide up. So you have to have the mag in here to drop this. And then be able to pull the slide back. Right? So that's being fire. Now here's the stupid thing. Even though, oh, you're like, okay, now this is dropped. I can pull the slide back. So I should be able to remove the mag. No. Because that little tooth right there falls down behind the ejection, uh, mag ejection button. So this gun's fucking dumb as far as that goes, as far as the stupid safeties go. So, yeah. all right, this is where it's going to become complicated to film. Oh, uh, there we go. Right, so you know, pull this back, lock it in. Right, this is the hard part right here. This this little thing you got on both sides, you have to push that forward, and it's extremely hard because this is attached to the recoil spring that is now pinched up in here, super tight because you have the slide back. You can do it without the slide back. But then it's a pain in the ass to get the barrel out. Uh, maybe, maybe not. Hold on. Pull it forward. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got to have the slide back. So, slides back. You really got to hammer on this thing forward. I mean, you almost you got to use both fucking hands. Oh, shit. Something broke. Wow, that really just broke. Huh. The bottom of that fucking safety just broke off. I wasn't even touching that. Well, I hope that doesn't do anything. Probably does. Why would it be on there? All right. Um. Okay. Well, back to this. So you really got to hammer home on this. Just to get the fucker out. It is insanely hard. Hell, I forget sometimes even what you got to fucking do. I think you pull it forward. Okay, no, you can do it with the with the slide forward. So leave the slide forward. Forget everything else I said. Keep the hammer back. Push push it forward so this little thing right here will move forward. You pull them both forward. Pull the slide back a little bit. That'll pop your barrel out. All right, now you should. You need to be very careful of that. The spring just fired out of here. All right, you don't want to lose that, so... And then, there you go. That's how you take it apart. No, I don't have, let me find that spring real quick. Oh, fuck it. 
throw a shirt on real quick because I don't want YouTube to fucking flag my video for nudity. Boop, bop, bop, bop. Ah, oh, I bet that fucker rolled right under the goddamn no. Where did it go? Eh. Oh my god. Are you fucking serious? <clears throat> I uh, seriously just lost that goddamn screen. That motherfucker, man. There it is. Fucking roll it under this goddamn chair. Oh. Fucking pain in the ass. Couldn't just be an easy fucking do. Nothing ever is. So. This is the thing <coughs> you're pulling forward on. And the reason it's so hard. Is because that spring is pushing back on it. And then. It sits down. I'm gonna fucking shoot myself. God. Got the wrong fucking thing. Again. So let's do this one more fucking time. Because nothing can be goddamn easy. Alright. Here's my fucking advice when putting this stupid shit back on. Alright? Everything's off. This barrel rocks. There's a pin right there that this little tooth grabs onto so the barrel goes in like that rocks down when you put the gun back together that's how you have to do it you have to go in from the top rock it down all right first thing you want to do is sit this back where it goes it's got teeth on it the teeth need to go in there sit down all right then you cannot put the slide on up here. It will not slide back. You have to put it on just in front of these right here with the back end of the uh, slide. These serrations, I'm sorry. All right. Then from here, you're going to be a lot better sitting that spring down in there like that. It's just going to ride in there like that. All right. Now, here comes the fun part. Okay. You're gonna have to keep your thumb on top of this spring. God damn it. That would fucking be why this gun is garbage. It's garbage to work on. Fucking stupid. Dumb goddamn California bullshit. If you fuck one goddamn thing up, that spring just fucking goes flying out of there. So, you might, if you take it apart, you may end up buying a fucking new spring because you're probably going to lose the fucking one that you have. So now the slide's fucking catching on something. What? I don't fucking know. All right. You just got to make sure the slide sat down in there, right? This gun is so fucking stupid to work on. 
All right. The spring is going to compress. You've got to keep your finger on there because there's nothing up here in the front of the slide keeping that dumb fucking spring from flying out of there. All right. So that's what it's going to look like. You put your thumb on the front of it. Ride it back. Oh, my God. Oh! This is going to be more like a goddamn comedy video. This is so fucking stupid. Let me put this motherfucking shit together. The guy that I'm doing this for, you better be fucking thankful. Oh my god, you fucking garbage. Okay, fucking Christ. So, if you have this side off, that bullshit will fall out because there's nothing fucking holding in there. All right. Can I finally fucking do this? Put your thumb on the spring. Ride it back. The slide might get caught a little bit. You just got to fucking work it through. Lock the son of a bitch in place. Holy fuck, are we going to do this? And then rock that down in, push it forward. Boom, bam. You're ready to fucking rock and roll. Holy shit. Can I get a like on the goddamn video for how asininely funny that was? Wasn't funny to me. I'm sure it was funny for everybody else. Not me. Because I had to constantly get on the fucking floor. But... For who, for the man that was asking me, that is how, that is the easiest way to get it apart. You just, I'm going to put this back on real quick. So that I don't have to go through that fucking hell again. I will tear it down one more time without all those fucking interruptions, hopefully. I don't know what that little piece did that just fucking broke off. I don't think it really matters. I don't know. It, it was on it for some reason, but it was probably a dumb reason. Dumb California retard reason. Who knows? I don't care. All right. Leave the slide forward. Cock it. Clear it. You have to have the mag in. We already went up over this. Otherwise, oh, I broke the safety. Right? No. Duh. No, I just, oh, I just made it easier to function. Yeah, that probably. Oh, I know what that was. That little thing that broke off, that little spring that's down here, keeps tension on this. Yeah, that's broke now. Well, I got to buy a new one of those. Oh, well, who fucking cares? Whatever. Eh, it's easier to work now. <laughs> now. I guess that's why they have two safeties on them. California, dumb. If they had just put a nice fucking single safety, they'd have been fine. Right, so... Little tab, pull forward, pull the slide back a hair, tab forward. God damn it. Probably the best way to do it is this. There you go. It'll pop the fucking barrel up. You have to be careful when you're lifting this barrel up. Because that spring will go flying. Best bet is probably... Just to fucking make... Yeah, there you go. Do that. Put it on the sofa. Then it won't go fucking flying anywhere. Barrel down. Fucking piece of shit. Take the spring out. Slide lifts up. Like, almost straight up. If you get it right past those serrations forward a little bit, lift straight up. You cannot put it on back here. It will catch this. It will not slide back past that. All right? And that's as far as I take it apart normally. You... You can clean it from there. All right. Slide. Back on. Make sure it functions. Little springy. 
that likes to fly 50 million different goddamn directions. Back on here, finger on it. See how, there you go. This, the front end of the slide is wanting to catch the uh, front of the, God damn it! what is this thing called? I haven't fucked with guns in forever. I haven't shot a gun in like a month. All right, finger on the spring. God damn it, and it still flies out. Oh my God. Holy fuck. All right, one more time. Finger on the fucking spring. Ride it back all the way. Safety up. Lock it in. Spring will not come out. This little thing. Thumb barrel on the thing. Rock it down. It'll lock into place. Boom, bam. You're done. Thank you for watching. I hope I helped whoever out was asking. That's going to be it from me. I will see y'all next time. God bless.